Well, we are going to hold these warm temperatures right through the weekend. In fact, the nation is actually cut in half. This information coming from the Climate Prediction Center. We are on the mild side of this. We hit 70s today. We're going to do that as we step all the way through the weekend until this strong cold front comes in and then we skip to the other side and temperatures next week, especially in the middle of next week, really going to struggle for us. But we did tie a record today, 74 degrees. That was our high, the old record, 1978. So we did tie a record and what a beautiful day it was. And you know, the sun went down at 441. I just want to show you this gorgeous picture coming in from Chuck in Naperville of the Springbrook Prairie Preserve, a gorgeous spot to go for a long, long walk. It's about 5.5 miles around. Gorgeous there. He took it just as the sun was setting. Thanks for that. 63. It's mild out this evening. We still have a south and southwesterly wind that with the sunshine today, all those southwest winds pulled in that warm air. That's why we made it to 74. And that's why it's so mild tonight because we still have that influence of that southwesterly wind. But we also have an increase of cloud cover. And this is all tacked on to a weak disturbance that's going to be moving through our state tonight. As you can see, increasing the cloud deck. No rain associated with this though. So it's going to be cloudy and mild in the morning, holding the clouds maybe until lunchtime, but we are hoping for a little break in the cloud cover late in the day as some dry air starts working in from the other side. So when you wake up in the morning, it's going to be cloudy and mild. We'll hold those clouds in the morning, but then hope for some clearing in the afternoon. But with that sun going down at about 20 to 5, it is uh, limited with how much sunshine we'll actually see tomorrow, but clear for sure as we get into tomorrow evening. But again, I think even starting with all the clouds, we have a few less hours of full sunshine. We still should be warming up to touch that 70 degree mark in many places. And we're going to stay with 70s on Friday too. In fact, our seven day planner shows this trend from now right through the weekend, each afternoon, making it into the 70s, that powerful cold front coming Tuesday with rain. And oh boy, Brad, what a change it brings in the middle of the week. See the tail end of that seven day? I think we should focus on the short term. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can't even see it actually. Just looking at those 70s. Thanks, MK.